Guys, what are we looking at today? Coconuts. Does anyone know where coconuts come from? Do they grow underground? No. Do they grow on the no. ground? No. They grow in? Trees. Oh, they grow in trees. And we can make lots of beautiful things out of coconut. Um, so we're going to go inside and try them out. Then we're ready to make a delicious banana coconut smoothie using this gorgeous coconut that we spoke about before. No. Yeah. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to attempt to open the coconut. Um, I haven't done this before, but I've seen it being done. And we need to go one, two, three, then ten, eleven. Just <laughs> <laughs> to get your anger out. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! I think it's a man's job. There we go. Leave it out there. Yeah, I think it's, I'm just going to test it out. Mmm. Mmm. Really yummy. Do you want to have a taste? So we'll pass it around. My phone be last. You like it? Delicious! Like you don't want to have a taste? Mina, pass it on. Delicious! It is, it's beautiful. It's cold and sweet. You don't like it? Try it now. Taste? Is Zoe having a taste? Yeah. What do you reckon, Zoe? Good. Yeah. What does it taste like? Mm. Is it sweet or is it sour? It's really sweet. Right, here we go. Oh, see? Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. We've opened up the coconut and inside you can see all the gorgeous young flesh and we can all have a little taste. Who would like to have a taste? Me. me. No, not me. Okay, so Maya, what you can do is grab a spoon. Uh, I have mm. <laughs> and then we're going to put the rest of it into our smoothie. We've got our coconut water. We're going to add in some bananas. Now these bananas have been frozen to make the smoothie extra cold. We're going to put in the beautiful coconut meat that we scraped out of our coconut. And we're going to put in some dates that we've also soaked with their water. And we've just got to make sure, I think I took all the pips out. Yeah. Take all the pips out of the dates and you put the dates in as well to make it extra sweet. And the other thing I'm going to add is a handful of almonds that have also been soaking. And together with the water, the coconut water, they're going to make like an almond milk. So we'll start with a couple of handfuls and we'll see how we go. Okay, we're just going to check and see what it looks like. Oh, it looks gorgeous. Nice and creamy. I think it needs a little bit more water and we're going to add some ice. Okay, let's have a little look. Really yum. Let's see what the kids think. And there's no milk in here. And look how creamy it is. Um, if you can't get your hands on a coconut, you can still make the smoothie without a coconut. Um, but if you can get your hands on coconuts from lots of Asian grocers or at any of the markets, um, they're fantastic, fantastic things known for their medicinal properties. People have been using them for thousands of years all around the world for all kinds of, kind of ailments and um, for their skin and for their hair and respiratory problems and the list goes on and on. So they do have a lot of health benefits. Yeah. Hi, thank you. We'll be making some yummy smoothies. Have a taste. What's it like, guys? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Zoe? Did you like it or love it, Jay? Yeah. Really, really good.